Hello, we are here with our next design, and this one is going to be day six, which is pine branches. One coat of the wet and wild, and this one is the sparkly, and I can't remember the name of it. Oh, I'll put it in the description box. So one coat of this over the top, and then on the tips of these three, I put my Bonita, and this one is called Tin Man's Brew. And then I went all the most, all the way up the nail on my ring finger, and almost all the way up the nail on my thumb. So now what I wanted to do was darken the tips a bit. I didn't want the um, very tips to be too light. I thought it wasn't enough color contrast. So I'm going to come in with my. Um, this is I bought from the Etsy online, and um, I bought it from a gal called Samantha, and she has a store which is called Incidental Twin. I will put a link in the description box to this beautiful color, which is called Doctor Who Fifty Fiftieth. Now I'm going to let these dry, get a top coat on them, and I'll be back to show you the design. Okay, I have all my supplies together, I'm top coated and I'm drying, so I thought what we would do is stamp out the designs. I'll be using the Bundle Monster Holiday Set Plate, and this one is number S214, and we're going to be stamping out this cute little candle right here. Then I want to stamp out from the festive collection plate and this is plate number eight and I'm going to be stamping this little section right here with the pine branches. Okay, so let's get a few stamped out. I'll be using the MDU in the regular green, number eight, and I'll also be using my MDU in white. I'll be using a Creative Shop with my Creative Shop scraper, and I'll also be using a Fab Your Nails. Okay, I'm going to get these cleaned up and top coated, let them dry, and I'll be back to show you what I plan to do.
Okay, here's my finished pine branches with my added red candles. I hope you enjoyed this design. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time.